Hi everyone, in this quick video I'm going to talk to you about an issue arises uh, as an eBay seller time after time after time. Um, I'm not sure about you but um, I've learned over the years uh, occasionally you, you will receive an email from a buyer and the email will keep on coming and basically it starts with a small email explaining their interest in an item and you go on on and you send the email back and these are a small very tiny amount of um, these items literally next to nothing you know i'm talking about less than 15 20 quid or even i've noticed uh five six pound worth of gear and it's kind of annoying i'm sure you've um, all the, the ebay sellers have come across this situation where you keep on sending them the information they want and they're not happy with it and they keep on sending emails and they will tell you oh i cannot get through your links and it's not allowing me and this and that and it goes on on and on and you get really frustrated uh, you know, the first thing you should do if somebody keep on sending you emails and things like that, either just reject them or uh, what I tend to do is look at their feedback. If they're a genuine eBay buyer and they have more than 40, 50 feedbacks, then it's okay, you know, you're wasting your time with this person. But if they have a feedback of less than 10, for example, don't waste your time you know just block the user um or what in my case what i tend to do is send an email explaining look the ebay is blocking you and don't give any reasons if they keep on sending you oh i cannot get to this link or i cannot find your item blah 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 just send them a nice email saying look so go and talk to the eBay and you must have put a block on your account or something. So that's why, that's the reason you cannot get to the um, the link. So I'm sure it doesn't happen to everybody, but it does occur in this game. I've, I've seen it time after time where they're not interested in buying your products. All they want interest is wasting your time. Uh, and so often people will actually um, send you an email, want to buy the stuff, they're not interested at all and they just want to see if they can knock the price down to next to nothing and you you have to sort of um, learn from those sort of people and it's it's difficult why well, if you're a new seller you don't have that experience and you're gonna f uh, fell in their trap so the best thing is the new sellers do not do not go into their mindset and start you know thinking oh ah, there's a good there's a good seller out there he's trying to buy my product well don't fall into that make sure you always look at their feedback look at what sort of response they have from other customers sorry the other sellers and then make up your mind i wasted so much time with those those people who kept on annoying emails so uh, i know you can block them but you know just ignore those people and carry on the good stuff so in a nutshell thank you so much for watching this video on all of my other video hope this info and uh, this video has provided a bit of information basically what it is if uh, if a buyer does not have any feedback beyond 50 60 100 don't bother you know, less than 10, forget it. You're wasting your time. So, thank you so much.